This week in Harrisburg, construction began on some new homes being built for homeless women and children. As News 8's Harrisburg reporter Portia Johnson found out, it's a project that could change the future for three families. This is what the 200 block of Hummel Street looked like nine months ago. This is what it looks like now, and this is what it will look like nine months from now. Three new townhomes for homeless families. I'm excited for, for, for the chance to be able to house more women and children. Bethe Suarez lives across the street in a rehabbed home. Her home and the new homes being built are owned by Brethren Housing Association. It's a nonprofit that helps women and children get back on their feet. For Suarez, it kept her from losing her children. Because we were sleeping in our car, you know, I would stop at a, at a little mini mart and wash up and then take my kids to school and allow them to be there all day, you know, eat breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Her story is similar to many single moms, and three of them could have an opportunity to live in these new townhomes. But Chris Fitz says BHA has more families in need than housing. We have 300 people every this past year that we've had to turn away that who apply to our program and that we had to turn away, unfortunately. And that Fitz says the families picked will be able to stay in the homes for up to two years. He says they will learn life skills and get job training through BHA. It's worked for Suarez. It, I've learned lessons that I needed that I could actually think that I can go out and rent a house on my own. But she tells me when she does leave, it won't be for good. She wants to come back and mentor the women who will soon be living in these new homes. Well, it's about one person helping the next person and sharing the information. In Harrisburg, Portia Johnson, News 8. BHA says this is a $600,000 project made possible through a partnership with Pinnacle Health.